Welcome back to Let's Play Rogue Galaxy. Yar took down Tupus Jokey and his J robot. His J. His Jopus robot, if you will. Yar. The shop opened up on the other side. As you can see, that that S over there. Uh, it's a shop where I bought two pieces of paper, which gave me additional quarries for, I guess, uh, more giant optional bosses in an area called Vidon. Maybe I can actually get to this place from here after two chapters of trying to get this damn visa? Hi! Welcome to the Galaxy Corporation. They solved the problem with that terrorist, and the mainframe's back up and running. I'm ready to process your request now. Oh, really? This time for sure? This time for sure. I mean, come on, that is my job after all. Duh. This is all we need. Please, can you issue us a new galactic travel visa now? Absolutely. What have you got? ZR-KJ1701, the Dorgan Arc. Looks like the category of this vessel is a free sailing freighter. All right. And there we go. Now you're all set. That's it? That's all it took? Ta-da. Do it fast and do it right. That's the motto of the Galaxy Corporation. We look forward to serving you again. Wait. I have two cards here. What's this? Oh, that's just a little present for me. Member number 78,500 is a bit high, but what can you do? <laughs> I didn't want this. Ta-da! Well, aren't you lucky. Thanks for your support! So after all that... Is that even gonna come in handy, or are you just taking up a slot in my fucking inventory? Cause man, I got a lot of items. <laughs> with yeah, weapons, I've been putting stuff back and all this space. stuff. Also with the stuff making with the factory. Man, that's a... Whew. That's a bit of a learning curve, that one. Wait, that's wrong. I gotta go back to the Dorganark, don't I? Huh, I guess. I mean, it doesn't say. Well, we got the visa, so I guess. Man, the factory. Whew. This place is nothing. Like, first you gotta make sure all the stuff is in the right spot. Make sure you got the materials. Alright, link it all together, because they take time to, like, meld, and they have to be, like, a certain number above or something like that to meld, from what I've seen. And then you gotta go over to the watcher contents. Like, you gotta plug That's everything into, like, all these little, uh... You gotta, like, actually build wires and stuff like that. It's... it's wow. I wasn't expecting to be, like, that level of what you call. Like, I take back what I said about the, uh house-making thing. I mean, that's... That's kind of child's play compared to what I had to do. Then again, I've already done that before. So most everything in that, I've had to look up. Mostly because I've spent hours upon hours just... getting all the weapons in place. with my uh, recording software. Hope it doesn't fuck up again here. I wonder with the travel visa now we can just go to like new areas or like backtrack to earlier ones. We're not on the wrong path, are we? So more weapon getting can continue. Huh? Hmm. Now this is a good looking ship. I like it, I like it. Hey, what are you doing here? I'll be on the most wanted list before long, right? My house is surrounded by soldiers. I have nowhere to hide. So, I decided to become a crew member here till things die down. Oh yeah? Says who? Says me! That's who! Jupus is a vital part of the Dorganark team! <laughs> this is good! <laughs> this is great! <laughs> so he bribed you. Mmm, this is so good! You folks are lucky to have me as a friend. It'll be nice working with you. Ow! Hey, what was that for? Hmm. You tried to kill us, so that's what that was for. 
Actually, you were the easiest boss fight ahead. <laughs> so I guess you're the Nico Robin of the group. You just decide to join. Ooh. Master Hacker. Oh, do we gotta go wake him? How many people are there on this ship? We're still around the ship. Okay then. Zegram! What the fuck are you doing back here? Me dazzle with my charm. Pick -a -a oh, the captain's waking up soon? Because they want me to tour around till then. Like Simon said. Jupus. They must be overwhelmed by my charismatic presence. I was just gonna say you look like the. Well, I don't wanna say that because I might. We, uh... <laughs> huh? What is it? Oh, for Jupus, what do you mean? Why, because he gave you eats? I could have done that. You see how many episodes it took me to get shit? Can't on you, Lilica. It can't hurt to take it easy once in a while. It'll be the serious Zora one of the crew. really get a good look at this. Last time I tried, I got jumped by a friggin' jellyfish. I wish Raul could see this. Yeah, get a good look at that. No stars moving, or is this just a backdrop? Anything on there? Nah, just a... If you want to catch a view, this is definitely the place. I think he usually says what usually people are thinking for the most part. How many people are there on this ship? Just casual conversation talking to himself. He's like, man, we gotta go back and get that whatcha call it. How long is this going to take to get to the friggin' travel visa? I think he said something along those lines. Hmm? Oh! There you are, Mr. Rogue! Hurry to the bridge. The captain has awakened from his nap. The captain? You mean Dorgan Goa? I get to meet him? In fact, I believe he has specific orders for you. Ah, Desert Claw! Taking orders straight from the boss, huh? Everyone's on the bridge already. You'd better get moving. All the places you didn't automatically take me to. Hey, Jaster. Quite a promotion, huh? I hear this next mission is all yours. Papa's usually not one to trust people. Good for you, Jaster. Good for you. <laughs> Maybe, if you're the real deal. All present and accounted for? My most distinguished pirates! Jorgen Goa, our great and honorable captain, has finally awakened! Company, fall in! The captain is on the bridge! I finally get to meet him. Dorgan Goa. Scala 
Wags, how are things? Guess I was out for a little too long this time. Well, can't very well sleep forever. It's time we go out and fulfill my ambition. So, did we ever find the Desert Claw? Yes, he's right here. Didn't you hear me? Where's Desert Claw? Uh, uh, um, right here, sir. Desert Claw is actually just here. What? This kid? You... 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 Take the Desert Claw? What? what? <laughs> but he's got to be just as terribly strong. There's no way. How could we be wrong on this? I know what Desert Claw looks like. And this snot-nosed little whelp don't look like Desert Claw. You tricked us! Good grief! Jaster, is it true? Uh... No, I just... I'm sorry. I meant to come clean sooner or later. Oh my goodness! Uh, what a frightful mess! Tie this imposter up and toss him overboard! Papa, wait! Jester might not be Desert Claw, but he's our friend. Please, Papa, don't punish him. What? Kisala? Why are you sticking up for this scurvy dog? While you were taking a nap, Jaster was a tremendous help to us. A true pirate never forgets his obligations, right? That's right. And Mr. Rogue's strength is for real. Captain, I guarantee without a shadow of a doubt, it'll be good to have Jaster around. We're begging you. Oh, let him stay in the crew, okay? Oh, now you have to pour it on. <clears throat> what a bunch of suckers. Captain! I can't hear myself think! Shut up! Scurvy dogs? Exactly whose ship do you think this is? You bunch of selfish crybabies. Jaster, was it? All right, then. I'll give you another chance. Let's see if you can prove your usefulness. Papa! That's our captain! However, if you screw up, it's curtains for you. You got that, Jester? Yes, sir. I understand. What is it that you'd like me to do, Captain? Hmm. But before that, all your dogs, clean out your ears and listen good. I'm gonna tell you of my top secret plans that I've been keeping you in the dark about till now. Really, Captain? Hmm. Well, this should be entertaining. So you're finally going to tell us. It is rather odd not even to tell your crew the reason for their voyage. Come on, Papa! Out with it! My ultimate goal is the legendary lost planet of Eden! Eden? Oh, I've heard of that. It's a phantom planet that vanished long ago. Yeah! And they say it holds enough treasure to allow anyone to rule the entire galaxy. Yeah, that's the one. And they say that on that planet, there are people there that live forever. You're not telling me you really believe in all that hogwash, are you? I remember now. Eden suddenly vanished from our galaxy some 10,000 years ago. Supposedly, they were even more advanced than Zerad. It is the utopia spoken of in legends throughout the galaxy. 
<laughs> you mean that old fairy tale? You can't honestly be serious. Shut up! I'm dead serious. It'll take one hell of a mission to be able to find the path to Eden and actually make it there. And that's why I ordered you to scout out the very best hunters. In other words, we are going to strip Eden bare of all its spoils. The galaxy's foremost treasures will be mine. Moncha! Aye, aye, Captain! Deadlights on the screen, mates! I take it you all know about the Geo Record. It's the galaxy's top adventure log, containing every kind of treasure. According to this, Eden has an undeniable tie to the Great Tablets. Great Tablets? Ancient tablets. We've been looking for them for ages. I get it now. That's why you've been so obsessed with them. If my intuition is correct, the secret that will open the path to Eden is hidden on the Great Tablets. But before we can get to Eden, we've got to get our hot little hands on those tablets first. According to my sources, a huge ancient tablet was excavated from a mine on Vedan just the other day. I don't know if this is one of the tablets, but it's certainly worth investigating. The mines are controlled by the Zax Morardi family, and they ain't pleasant to deal with. <coughs> Listen up, Jaster. You're going down to Vedan to find out if that tablet is legit. Aye, aye, Captain. <laughs> Succeed, and I'll permit you to stay. Oh, that's great news, Jester. I was a little nervous for a second there. Huh. You're not getting soft on me, are you? <laughs> Didn't you notice? Something special about him. Of all the warriors I've come across in my life, this is only the second one that's given me this feeling. Is that right? And who was the first guy? Desert Claw. The real one, that is. <laughs> So this is Vedan. Over 40% of the galaxy's metal ore and minerals are mined here on Vedan. The vast resources available here make it one of the top mining planets. Looks kind of dark. Uh-huh. The sun never rises in this mining sector. This place is also known as the City of Eternal Night. Pretty romantic, don't you think, Jester? City of Eternal Night. So? Where do we start? Well... We'll have to go to the mines if we want to check on this tablet. Most likely they only allow authorized people to enter. We should start off by heading into town and try to find a way into the mines. So Vedan's like Fenmont. Stand near the helm of the ship at the Dorganos control and... Hey! We do get fast travel. Just get solid with me right now, huh? I needed some exercise anyway. That's 
good because I bought a fuck ton of weapons for the people who weren't there and still got to work with them. Also, I think last I checked, I'm closing in on rank 40 on the, uh... This elevator, I guess. That was going to take me up or, like, across or something. I wonder how far we've gotten. Oop, there's a chest over there. Went over there. Sucks can't jump off that way and go back. Gotta, gotta take the long way. Also gotta be on the lookout for uh, people with like yellow dots because they'll have ideas for the factory. I'm gonna make everything yet. I need more of those. Right now I got one set up, but I need more uh, mushrooms. I got one mushroom on me right now. Maybe with the watcher call it now I can go back to uh, that jungle planet Jerica and get some. I think that's where I got them. Meanwhile, Doctor Picacho, Doctor Picacho, can you hear me? Yes, the connection is excellent, Steve. And I'm glad to see that you seem to be doing well, too. Of course I am. That's because of your brilliant design, Dr. Picaccio. <laughs> so you've learned how to do flattery now, huh? That's quite an accomplishment. Listen, I'd like to make a small adjustment. Do you mind if I take control of your circuits for a while? Not at all. Be my guest. <laughs> Mark, what's space like? It's fantastic, and totally different than I pictured. It's like the stars go on forever and ever. I really have to thank you, and Steve. You're welcome. And the great tablet. What's that? It's this really huge treasure. With the great tablet, you can go to this paradise called Eden. So now we're all looking for it. Eden, huh? I wish I could see it in person. I'll tell you all about it. I'm glad. I'm looking forward to that, Mark. Just leave it to me. Gosh, I can't believe how excited I am. Okay. Now I can use the save point. And Jupus is woefully underleveled. Wow, 21. Everyone's sitting pretty at the mid to high 30s. And she's starved on money, as you can see. It's all about all this other stuff, though. Ah, uh, you know what these are? These are probably what you call it. It's like what you call it in the, uh... I think some things you learn how to make and then it'll be available in shops where you can buy. That's the other chest over there. Three lubricants. Still nothing new new so far. if Jupus will be joining us. I don't want to, so I'll gain experience, but in the end, I kind of don't. Because he's low level. Um, wait for me. Tran is bound for minus station. New. Let's keep this pace up. Let's take the long way for now. Uh-oh, this part's coming up blocked off. Is a train for minus station? I see something here in the corner. 
Scoot my puzzles always. What other treasures can I get down here? Are we just going around in circles? To the untrained eye, yes, Kisala. But you see, I am searching for treasure. After all, I am the one who broke out of Rosencaster prison and took down a star god. Actually, you were there for that one part, weren't you? Ha ha ha. So even if you didn't tell me where Desert Hall, you could have told them that shit. Like, LC was there, he could have vouched for you there. Alright, now let's go to Mina Station. Okay, that was cool, I guess. There's just one big lot where I'm trying to... Once again, look around and see if I can find anything. I went all the way on the end here. I can't open that. I'd like to come back here on my day off. Hmm? What's that you're selling? Oh no, it's passports, I guess. I, needed some exercise anyway. I thought it was like an ad for like chocolate or something. It's like brown bars. I'm like, hmm. Most expensive imported chocolate you will ever have. All right here. Pretty rough and tumble town. Ooh, wow. Looks like we're getting finally out more into the big city itself. Can I open this first? Uh oh. Come on, bomb. Uh oh. How much zen did I lose? Wow. That cut me down a bit. Couple of things for Jupus real quick. I remember going into this thing, the watch got was lit up. I'm like, oh yeah, he's a new party member. Let's see what he gets. Armag boost. Increase all attack power. Protect Tom Contraption attacks each enemy in succession. And of course Burning Strike, because I had another... The, the scrolls. Hmm? Hold up, old man! You think you can get away with this? Are those... Marathi's men? The coast is clear. Ah. Sorry, didn't mean to frighten you. Don't worry, I don't bite. My name is Burton. I'm an explorer who came all the way out here to examine the ancient tablets they discovered in the mine. Hold on a second. You're here for that too? Oh, ho! so you know about them. I bet you're here gathering info yourselves as well. In that case, how about we swap data, eh? Um, well, sure, but we don't have much yet. Well, so far, I've managed to learn that the miners hang out in a place called Angela's Bar. I reckon if we go there, we'll be able to find out something. The only thing is, I have no idea where the place is. How about you? Angela's bar? Huh. There he is! Uh-oh, this isn't good. Wait! Burton! Huh? Hey, you guys! You're in cahoots with that old coot! Huh? What do you guys want? What's going on? Oh. <sighs> I don't like this. Hey, come on! How did we get involved? Man, we're just making enemies everybody in this game. That's your mistake, not mine. Bam! I'm like, wait, what am I thinking? Any enemy that wants to be tricky, I'll just... I forgot to change weapons. How dare you defy the Marathi clan? No! Oh! If you know what's good for you, you'll get lost! Uh-oh. Now we've gotten their attention. That old guy mentioned something about Angela's bar. Maybe we can learn a few things if we go there. All right. Let's try to find it. I'll place this bug. Well, 
Yes, there's always the game to point me out in the, that direction, at least. First. The arrows. I'm gonna fight a lot more of them before we're done. Unless, of course, they become normal ass enemies at this point. Oh shit. Uh oh. We're going stray dogs? We fought you before, didn't we? Or no. There's like petite dogs and everything. Okay. Those guys were no challenge at all. Wait, is this the way I'm supposed to be going? Trains run right in the middle of the street? Wrapping back to some other place now. Not a problem. Whoa, it's a train. That would do damage to us if it hit. Let's keep this pace up. Will that actually take me anywhere? How big is this place? Zombies. Kind of weak. Oh, they poison. Well, they are zombies and undead. Get that rot on you. I keep forgetting to get those save points to actually bring out weapons, although that might take a lot longer. You got a lot of stuff to bring out. Again, shit I can do on my own time. Seems to be the same way I do a lot of this exploration, but you never know. Now, yeah, the same point over here. Moose. There's a shop over here as well. That oh, is you. There's a guy over here too. Trimble. What you got? I didn't make a lower enemy's attack power. It gives us all the ingredients. And now I wait the while to look up how exactly they do it. Wasn't expecting SimCity, the factory thing, like just all that connecting and everything. Ancient daggers coming soon. Hmm. Coming soon means you might not be the high enough level yet, I'm not sure. Demolition pod. Wait, who open is that? It doesn't say. Oh no, it's coming soon, that's why. Special standard equipment for Digo. Who's Digo? He's got axes. Does that mean you have the spear, Jupus? Yes, okay. Maybe we'll meet Digo here. There's a chest over on this side. Caught the corner of my eye on the way out of here. Naked without a third party member out here, though. Maybe if I just go to the bar and do it. Sounds dangerous. I'm just gonna do that now. Let me go there. Uh, yeah, they're all hanging out here. Whoops! Didn't know there was a drop there. Damn, we're fighting dudes out here. Took them down. See this treasure chest over here. Ah, it's a mimic. Oh no, it's a dust box. Ooh, that hit hard. Ooh, that hit hard! Oh, good lord. Now I really feel naked. Wait, what is it? Burning strike? Go. Ah, shit. That one came by quickly. Still, that's not bad, a foul. We can do this. Only cost us two potions, but we did it. Pretty rough and tumble town. Whew. Well, this might be more the same where shit attacks us, but that's okay. I got desert wind to get me through. So I'm gonna do these what you call so quickly. Only thing it takes really long is like I want this weapon and this weapon and this weapon. 
Because I'm the kind of asshole that just wants it all now. And if I can get it, I'm gonna get it. So this game just feeds all my, uh, kind of addictions when it comes to RPGs and stuff like that. And it's like, oh, I can do all this right now? Yeah, really? Yeah, okay. All right, let's do it. Popping <laughs> up like crazy. Maybe I'm actually getting to a point where maybe the, maybe that boss actually was tough, that giant robot last episode. And I was like, okay, I was able to beat it because I'm that decently leveled. I better hold on to my watch I calls in case I run into something that really does require the uh, desert wind to get past. Those guys were no challenge at all. Angela's boss. them again. Mommy, is Daddy here? I'm not sure, darling. Well, he might be, but he might not be. Out of the way! Just trip, that's all. Mommy! If Daddy were here, he'd beat up those bad guys. When are we gonna see Daddy? I'm sorry, honey. I'm so sorry for putting you through all this. Your daddy, he's working really hard to help people, to help the world. I'm sure we'll find him soon. So hang in there, okay? Okay, I'll try, Mommy. That looks really bad with the plastic tails, but aww. Also sad. Holy shit, how big is this place? Do I even want to do this on my own? Do I want to adventure all this on my own? Let's see what comes up. Here they come. Death grows. Oh, you're weak as shit. You got a lot of health, though. I used to kind of balance you out a bit. That was a cinch. Ah, new item, Captain Sock. Something for Jaster? Whirlwind level 2. What was Whirlwind again? I forget, but I get Faded Passion. Wind resistance 1 and unconscious defense. Increased movement speed enables direct contact. Oh, okay. Look, it's got something too. Oh, the skull I picked up earlier. What's a serpentine arrow? Well, that sounds sick. Gotta watch your ass out here, man. Fucking mafia all over the place. Which, if that's the case, they might already be making it to the uh, ruins as well. Probably already there guarding the place. I figure everyone's after this Eden thing. It's the one piece of this game, I'm sure. Anyway, there's Angel's Bar. So I'm being Frogmans. More like Desert Wind, you're all dead men's. Stella! Crystal. Yeah, they're already outside the friggin' bar. Perfect heals. Another Stella Crystal. Let me see real quick before I pop in. I managed to get a uh, Fire Resistance Level 2 for uh, Jasta with them crystals. You got Star Charm too, so maybe that could be like an alternate uh, thing that makes me one-shot enemies. Give me another. Come on, that's enough, Digo. Oh, drop it, would you? Why can't I drink as much as I want? <sighs> Come on.
Come on, cut it out. You never used to be like this. What happened to the old Digo, the heroic soldier? Look at you. You're just a shell of your former self. And look at me, silly enough to fall in love with such a miserable man. Oh, this again. I'm tired of talking about the past. Diego. Oh, I'm sorry I didn't see you there. Something to drink? This way. Oh, it's that old guy. <laughs> what was that for? All I did was just ask around about the tablet. Oh, uh, sorry about that. All this secretive sniffing around. Guess you still have no idea. Gail. Keep sneaking around, and you'll be putting your life at stake, old man. No, I, I was just... <laughs> Haven't seen you before. <clears throat> Something's fishy. Who are these guys? They are my customers, Gale. And while they're in my bar, you don't get to hassle them. Huh. Look, this is a very important time for our town. Don't do anything that would make anyone suspicious. That goes for you too, Angela. <sighs> Got a problem with that? No? Good. Just remember, defy Zack's Moriarty, and you won't survive for very long in this town. So don't try anything stupid. Got that, Angela? And Digo, Got your tail between your legs as usual. All that money you scraped up in the mines? Was that just to buy yourself some drinks? You definitely are a loser, Digo. Pathetic. Move. It's fate that has brought us together! Say, big fella, you look like you work at the mine. Is there a secret entrance to that place? Would you be so kind as to show me? Oh. No thanks. I'm not getting involved. Oh, come on. Please! Don't make me tell you again. I won't do it. Oh, I see how it is. You're afraid of that fella. You look pretty tough, but you're really just a wuss, aren't you? What? Whoa, wait a second. Don't get mad. This has been a dream of mine. They found an ancient tablet in a mine on this planet. Its archaeological value is absolutely mind-boggling. I can't die until I've gazed upon that tablet and unlocked its secrets. Come on, can't you help an old archaeologist's dream come true? A dream come true? So that's your dream, huh? You bet! Tell me, you got money, old man? <laughs> oh, oh, that's rich. Oh, my. Have faith, good fellow. Money is no object for me. All right. Hey, why don't we go with them, Jester? Oh, so you two want to help as well? Sure. Can we come along? Are you serious? Of course! Of course! All right, then it's settled. The Burton Caravan is off to find the Great Tablet! Then we better leave soon. First, you need an ID card. The item shop downtown should have some black market cards. Gale's got his eye on you, old man. You stay here. We'll get the card for you. We got a new party member. Yay, now we're three again. Oh, 
I see. Yes, all right. But you know, I will get a little lonely. Oh, don't worry. I'll be happy to keep you company. Ah, yes? That sounds marvelous. Ah, haven't had a drink with a beautiful woman in quite some time. Very well, good luck out there, troops. Oh, and feel free to take your time. Huh? She's gonna bleed you dry with all your time. She's like, ooh, buy the expensive one. Oh, I used one key to get another key. All right, awesome. Mine is Marathi territory. Maybe else in here? No. Well, we got Diggo. I gotta go back and probably buy him more shit. Look at that fucking axe. It's so badass. What was your sub weapon? Probably that big, uh, big hand cannon there. Look at you. It's all drinking water, ain't you? <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> Also, fucking Crispin Freeman, is that you again? <sighs> it's been a while. It's gonna be a while before I see you next time on Let's Play Rogue Galaxy.